So now I'll be showing you a technology that we have uh, created to control the mouse pointer using the gestures. So we have created a code that converts the gestures into mouse pointer coordinates which is then used to control the mouse pointer. So basically I have defined three different types of gestures to do the same thing which a normal mouse would do but by using your normal intuitive hand gestures. Now I'll show you how we have done this to control a normal mouse pointer and hence control a Google Earth software for example here. So if I place these two fingers in this surface I can move my mouse depending on where my position of the finger is. So this is the XY coordinate and I'm moving my finger in that XY coordinate and then it's translated into mouse coordinates of your computer. As you can see I have my mouse pointer coming up, coming in the second screen. I can move my mouse pointer around by just this hand gesture. So again this gesture means move the pointer this gesture means do not move the pointer. I can use normal mouse to control it. So now if I want to pinch my Google Earth that means click the Google Earth and move it around I can use this gesture. So if I place my uh, if I navigate my mouse on the Google Earth and then pinch the Google Earth you can see the hand pinch down there. That means I have grabbed the Google Earth. Now if I would like to move the Google Earth around I just have to put all all three fingers together that means I can grab at the same time move the Google Earth. So as you can see now I have grabbed it I am going to move the Google Earth around. So I can move, rotate the Google Earth. It's quite intuitive and it's quite easier. Now if I want to scroll in or scroll out, I can do the same thing by my scrolling gestures. So for example, if I want to scroll in, I can just pinch these two fingers out like this, in this formation, and it scrolls out my Google Earth. So I'll be doing that now, if you can see that. So if I'm scrolling out, see that? It's going out. If I want to scroll in, I do the opposite and it's causing the Google Earth. So basically I can do the same, I can do multiple gestures to control the mouse and this is not only to control the Google Earth but I can control any of my software. I can even control LabVIEW using these gestures because now this is essentially my mouse.